Hey guys, and welcome back to my plain old Minecraft. I don't remember when that, what episode it is. I'm pretty sure it's episode number eight. And I have been doing these recordings for quite consistently lately. Like, I've already made maybe three within like seven days. Not necessarily a week from Sunday to Saturday, but yeah. So yeah, so last episode we left off and we just sort of made our start point to where we're going to build our mob grinder. And today we're actually going to build our mobs grinder. So let's get to it. And of course, there's going to be a lot of mobs around here, so let's just ignore that and let's keep going. Let's just go up. Ugh. Ugh. Oh, jeez. The lag. The lag. Okay. This is going to take a while, so, you know, I'll be back once we get up to the top. Okay? Be right back. Okay, guys. Now we are clearly up at the top. And I'm actually going to go here and I'm going to turn off fog. It might be affecting my frame rates. Okay, good. We're getting a very solid 30. Almost. Almost, yeah. Almost, anyways. So let's see. We're going to build our farm right around here, I guess. Right here. So this is going to be where the mobs will drop down. And this will. I'll probably put a hopper here. And there's going to be all these sorting rooms branching off from this direction. It's sort of going to be like a sky base up in the sky where I can store things. So yeah, we're going to be right here. We probably need more dirt here. So what we're going to do, we're going to make like a separate ladder up here. Oh, we dropped the ladders off. Eh, whatever. Okay, anyways, first of all, we need to create an infinite water source. So, let's see, where are we going to put this? I'm just going to... Uh, huh. I'm just going to make this out of dirt because I want to be able to remove this later. Doot, doot, doot. Let's just dig the corners out because we're going to have to use all the dirt we can use. I guess there we go. Let's take these two water buckets because I'm going to need them later. But yeah, we got ourselves water. And I'm not going to fill these up right now. I'm actually going to fill up all six of these, actually. One, two, three, four. Well, I lied. Everything but one. Oh, come on. Okay, so there we go. Let's do that. Let's go up. So usually mobs take around um 23 hits. Huh, okay. So how are we going to do this? So this is going to be the thing, and I want them to be around one punch. I want to do this. I want to make this using pistons. I want to make it so that... We could use it for whatever we need to do, like MCM mode training, where we could kill them with swords. Or other things, like using our fist to kill them to get experience, or, you know, all that jazz. So we're probably going to have to want something like a vine up there, but that's going to be a problem. We might... If we could get a cobweb, that would be nice. We prob... How else can we slow it down? Hmm. Yeah, I'm not entirely sure, but for now, we're just going to pillar up. This is going to be where they land, so 23 is what it kills so no yeah 23 is the perfect amount to kill so uh yeah we're just gonna go up 23 blocks from here and it's gonna be 22 um one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty twenty one twenty two twenty three so theoretically if i were to fall from here uh geronimo we would have half a heart left. Of course, I think I regen like at the last moment. Moment, so yeah, that's the thing. So yeah, you know, actually, I'm gonna go back down really quickly, and I'm gonna get some ladders. Okay. Okay, we're safe. Okay, let's go get our stuff right here. Let's also harvest these reeds while we're at it. There we go. Let's just get our reeds right here, like so, and we just get this. There we go. Okay, let's go. Um, just over here. Let's get this going. Okay, so let's go outside like so. Up here. Uh, just a few reeds away. And where were our ladders? Our ladders were right here. There we go. So yeah, um, so I linked the video for the grinder I'm using, which is a design created by Ito, and like I mentioned in the last episode, but just in case you didn't hear. So yeah, I put the video on how to make it and how to build it and all that different mechanical stuff that you want to build. Well, I put a video in the last episode and I'm not going to put it in this episode because I'm too lazy and I'm not going to do it. So yeah, so if you want to see how to build this thing on your own by step-by-step -step process, then you can go over to that video that I put on the last episode and you can go watch it to your heart's content. So yeah. Okay, we're just almost there, I guess. Um, so I guess we could just wait this out for a while. Of course, it's going to be really awkward because I have nothing to say. Huh. 
yep this is also the reason why i want ladders to be a lot more quicker and still that is not what happens much sadness so let's just keep on climbing we're almost there almost it's quite scary how everything is like this up 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 come on we can do this all righty so let's climb up this side one two do do so yes, theoretically this should be close enough to a sure kill. And uh, I have got an email message. And let's just ignore that for now because we are recording right now. We can't deal with this stuff. So yeah. So we're gonna have to build out like so. I'm actually gonna replace this with stone bricks right now. So we can use it later. So there we go. So I believe the first we have to do, we have to go from, so we know the middle point is right there, though it's really hard to see because of the, the textures are really, really nice. Anyway, so this is gonna be where the hole is. So we're gonna have to build nine from here, I believe. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. If I'm not mistaken, yep. And so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Another like so, like let's just build out like this. One, two, no, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, oh, one more, and I also I I keep getting, I keep getting email messages. Please let me get it. Okay, I got it. Okay, let's just build this out one more. Like so, okay, there we go. And finally, the last part. Oh, I'm a really slow builder. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, from here, we're gonna have to build out one, two, three, like so. Another on this side. I've built this quite a few times, so I do, I believe I've got this down by heart. And I will be able to do this out of memory because it's a really nice design. It's really easy to build. No pistons, no nothing. And it works pretty well, I believe. Hopefully. I'm going to try to opt optimize it as much as I can, but until then, let's just keep on going like so. Okay, so we got that. Dude, okay. Okay, this is going to take a while, and I more than that thought. Let's just keep on building on this side. Make them like square. So 9 by 3 around here, around the, from the center point, if you know what I mean. But yeah, oh geez. Okay, there we go. And one, oh gosh, one, two, three. I, I can see the trees, mom. I can see my house from here and I literally can. Actually, I can't literally can. Um, from the corner, I guess we could see it, I guess. Maybe, who knows, I can't see. I cannot see it at all. So yeah, oh, come on, come on, let me place. There we go. All right, and there we go. So from here, I believe we go from here and we go one, two, three, I believe, or maybe it's a four. I'm, I need to test this out and see. So on the other side, I'm pretty sure it has at least three. Like so, up oh, another email. Oh gosh, I'm gonna deal with that and I'll be right back. All right guys, be right back. Okay guys, we are back. And okay, I hope you don't hear any background noise in the background because um, my, my sister is watching a video, so. You're gonna, you might be able to hear some stuff. Okay, so I believe from here it's one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Yeah, one, two, three, four. I think I got this, so yeah. So let's see, one. So there's gonna be a block there. One, two, three, one, two, three. Uh, one, yeah, okay, we got this right. Okay, so it's gonna be a uh, nine. We're gonna have nine blocks away from the center and then three wide. And from those three wides, go a block down and you go another three wide and then you go and then you do one, two, three, four, and one, two, three, four, and then you have a block in the corner, like so. And then you just fill these in, because you're gonna have to fill these in, I believe. And before I continue, I'm probably gonna have to watch the video again because um, uh, I'm gonna have to do some redstone in order. To oh, okay. Well, yes, another email message. I sh yeah. Anyways, yeah, let's keep on building. I'm gonna finish this part, show you guys how to do it, and yeah. So one, two, three, one, two, three, four, corner block. One, two, three, four, one, two, three. 
All right, let's fill this in. Do 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 do. Do, do 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 okay please please excuse me excuse me this is so unprofessional i am so sorry <laughs> i am so sorry but i can't do anything about it darn you windows 8 i never use your mail app <laughs> so yeah that's the thing so yeah we're almost done on this side i do we have to do that side yeah we have to do that side oh come on there we go that's much better Oh, come on, we ran out of stone bricks. With this amount, we might only be able to do um half. We might only be able to finish like maybe a layer or two, maybe a layer and a half. I mean, that's what I estimate with the amount of blocks that we have. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. Corner block. One, two, three, four. One, two. So let's fill this in. Like so. Oh god. Okay, I can do this. I can do this. Okay. That's a lot of spam clicking and a lot of email notifications. But anyways, yeah. So this is going to be your base template of what you're going to have to have. So it's not it, once you do it a lot of times and if you use this grinder a lot, you know, you memorize this by heart. So yeah. So um, for now, you're going to have to place three. You're going to have to make a two high platform like so. If you can see in the video, it's going to be a block away from the outer blocks because that's going to that's where the wall is going to be. And you're going to have to have too high because so like there's going to be a water stream that goes down here to the center and you don't want pe um, mobs to jump back up, up to the platform. So you're going to have to do that. So yeah, and you basically do that for this area too. Um, nope, that's stone. Let's get our brick out. So one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, three, one, two, oh, another one. I apologize for everything. This is all my fault. Anyways, so yeah, never do that. You're gonna have to get your stone slabs, and you're gonna have to place it right here. And the reason for this is because is to prevent spider spawns. And just to mention, with this grinder, you can't get endermans to spawn. Well, you could adapt it to make endermans to spawn, but you have to replace all these blocks with a block that endermans can't take, and you have to be sure that it can't teleport anywhere else. If that's the case, you can make an enderman farm. However, you cannot have spiders because spiders are two by two and it's not going to go into a one by one hole. Logic. Now, in order to prevent them from spawning, we're going to have to put a half half slab in the middle because for a spider to spawn, it needs a three by three. I'll, I'll repeat, three by three spawning space. Now, if we put a block here, it's going to it's going to try to check. The game's going to try to check and see if this is a three by three platform and see if we could spawn a spider. However, it's blocked by this half slab because it is in the way. So therefore, it's not going to spawn it. And since this is going to be too high, there's obviously going to be no enderman. So yeah, so you're just going to have to do this the same way. So like there's going to be four in the middle around the center corner like so. And you're also going to have one, two, three, one, two, three over on this side. So yeah, I will be back. I have to check the video again and see how I could install the lighting system so I could turn the mob grinder on and off. And I also have to see if everything's good to go. So I'm going to do all the work around here, um, make the walls and everything. And we're, we'll be back after we finish the first floor and, and after I, you know, yeah, deal with other things that I will deal off camera. Okay, we will be back. After I eat some steak. Oh no. Okay. Be right back. Alright guys. Um, I finished the spawning platforms. This is where everyone's going to spawn. And um, before I do anything further. I apologize for the background noise in the background. It's uh, yeah. Same thing. My sister's watching video. And it's on speaker. And I'm not going to tell her to stop. Because. Because it's Crash Course. Or something. Or SciShow. Anything that has to do with the vlog brothers. But yeah. So, okay, so when we're gonna build the walls, there's a few things you have to keep in mind. So first of all, we're gonna have to build the outer part, but the thing is, you're gonna have to keep the first block, the first layer of this block empty, like so, like this. If you're to do it like this, you have to keep this empty because you're gonna have to put water here and that's where the stream's gonna go. Anyways, I'm not gonna do anything about that, so yeah, there we go. Um, so yeah, you have to keep in mind that. Um, if we keep on building this way, um, I've been running out of um, stone bricks, so I decided to just use the smooth stone because I'm just like, what the heck, YOLO. So yeah, we're gonna keep on building like so. And once we get to this part, here's another important part. In order to get an extra spawning sp space, ugh, my tongue's being twisted right now. So if in order to get another space for spawning, you can actually put a block right there. And you're also gonna have to put water down here. Oh gosh, that's fast, what the heck? 
Okay, that was that was really awkward. That was really weird. It's just like super speedy water. But yeah, anyways, if you put a block like so, you're gonna actually get an extra spawn space. So you roughly get around a hundred, I guess. I don't know, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Twelve times eight is um ninety-six. And yeah, you get exactly one hundred spaces, spawning space, spaces for each layer. And just to mention, I, I really forget to mention things. This mob farm is stackable. And so you can actually make as many layers as you want. Um what Ether recommends is um five if you to make it sort of hit the max, but you can build a multiple layers to just give yourself more ease and whatnot. It's hard to explain. I'm not that good at explaining. But yeah, we're just gonna keep on building this wall. I know I said I'm gonna have to um I want to do this off camera, but I want to show you guys the little this little part over here and over there so you guys don't mess up later because you might not be able to catch it the first time you see it at first glance so yeah let's do this like so like so okay we are almost well not almost done I think we're like 50% done but you know close enough okay One more time. One, two, one, two, one, two. It's like, oh gosh, okay. We ran out of stone bricks. There we go. Uh, bricks right here. One, two, one, two. There we go. So we have that, and we're going to actually have to build this another three high. So one, two, three. One, two, three. So this is where they're going to spawn, and we're going to have to put a roof up here. Um, we're in, we don't have enough stone brick. We might need an extra four more stacks of stone. Oh jeez, oh god. I, oh gosh, I almost fell off. I was accidentally pressing the D button and I was going to the right. Dang it. Anyway, so yeah, I'm gonna build up right now. And I will be back with you guys after I cook up some stone later on after I finish this wall. And we're gonna finish, I'm gonna finish the ceiling off camera. And yeah, I'm also gonna add the lighting system for later, later. For now, we're gonna have just one layer. We're gonna finish one layer this episode because it also takes quite a while to build this up. So yeah, um, okay, I'll be right back. Okay guys, we are back. We're gonna just um, repair our armor like so, so we can get some repair levels. Like you say, we're getting tons of it in the beginning. There we go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. That was really loud, but I guess we could deal with it for now, so yeah. We got a lot of repair levels for that, and yeah, um, our goal is to get at least 600, and that's going to be a while, but I still want to aim for that level, so yeah. Um, I'm still cooking up stone right now, so uh, there's really nothing I can do, I just have to wait, and we're going to have to get enough stone to finish up that wall. But yeah, we will be right back once we finish up the stone, and we're going to finish up that first layer, and we're going to see how it goes. Of course, actually, I should probably co cook up some glass as well, because... Well, as you can see, there's going to be a tooth that goes all the way down, and, well, we don't have a lot. Oh, we have a lot of glass. Never mind, we don't have to cook up anything. Okay, yeah, be right back. Hey guys, just decided to move the anvil right to the bottom of the floor. Oh, oops, press the E button. Anyways, let's go check and see how much is done. Um, my, let's just start taking the stone out right now. It's not a big deal, though I do. It does conflict with my perfectionism. My weird fetish of making everything perfect, but I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure a lot of people have that, so you know, no worries. So yeah, we got a lot of bit of stone. Let's make a lot of bricks. We need about like four stacks. Like if I estimate by my estimations, I believe we will need around four stacks of wood. I mean stone bricks. And of course, since I know it's gonna take a long way to go back up, I am gonna pause the video right here and we're gonna go back up. Hey guys, just for another update, we are back. I finished the walls and everything. And just in case you guys want to, um, if you want to install lights like I am doing so, what you gotta do, you just have to make your wall, and from your wall it is one, two, three blocks away. So just place two blocks, and then the third block should be the redstone lamp away from your final spawn pad, if you can see it visually. It's hard to explain with words, but yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, from the wall, eh. Yeah, it's, uh, whatever. I'm done explaining. Anyways, I'm gonna um, finish the wall, and we're gonna start working on the redstone. This is this might be a long episode, but you know, it's fine. It's fine. We can finish this soon, really soon. So yeah, let's just eat a bit of steak. 
and I shall be back.